VR is now supported in Dreams, bringing a whole new dimension to play and creation. With it comes a number of new dream surfing features, which will help you get the most out of your Dreams VR experience. When playing Dreams in VR for the first time, the best place to start is with Media Molecules All Aboard VR. This short VR experience will introduce you to some important new controls. You will need to complete All Aboard VR to unlock your VR preferences. Among these is Comfort Mode. When this preference is enabled, camera motion is reduced or removed. Comfort Mode is switched on by default, but you can disable it in the VR section of the My Preferences menu. If there are no puppets or cameras in the scene, you will be able to move freely using your controller. When moving with the controller, you will see a vignette around the edge of your view. You can change the strength of the vignette using the slider in the My Preferences menu. Set it to zero if you wish to turn it off. Now let's jump into Dream Surfing and see what's new there. Dreams VR Inside the Box is Media Molecule's VR showcase. It features a number of VR games, art installations and interactive puzzles. When you play a dream in VR, you will see a VR compatibility label and an experience rating on its cover page. The label is set by the creator to indicate how compatible their creation is with VR. The experience rating is set by players, indicating how experienced in VR they think a player needs to be to play it. A rating of 1 indicates that it's suitable for people new to VR. A rating of 3 indicates that it's best for people experienced in VR. If you're unsure about playing something with a higher VR rating, you can choose to play in cinema mode, a virtual big screen. You can play any dream with your VR headset, but they may not be optimised to be played that way. In some cases you will only be able to play them in cinema mode. If a dream's frame rate drops below a certain threshold, the view in your headset will automatically switch to cinema mode. You can prevent this from happening in most cases by enabling Allow Low Frame Rate in VR in the My Preferences menu. But there's a minimum threshold for our VR performance standards. Below that, the setting will not apply, and you'll be switched to cinema mode anyway. If you only want to see creations which are compatible with VR, you can choose to filter all unsupported content. And if you're interested in creating your own VR games, first check out what's new in Dream Shaping and watch our useful tips. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, give it a like and subscribe to the channel for more helpful how-tos as well as lots of other good stuff.